Week one is here for the first game in Washington Commanders history. We have taken over the team and made some big decisions about the roster that are hopefully going to get us into the playoffs this year. He might be a rookie, but we're starting him at quarterback. Sam Howell is set to be the future of this franchise. He's only a 67 normal, but we're hoping we can win MVP or do something with him to get him up in development trait. Eric Ebron's new at tight end, and then we're going to feature our dirty receiving core in Terry McLaurin, Dimey Brown, and Jahan Dotson. I mean, look at that glorious defensive line. The only really change on the defensive side is Legereus Snead. We picked him up from the Chiefs. Our first media day. Ooh, what's this going to be? What do we need to do to beat the Jags? We need to have dominating offense. That's 100%. We want to be an offensively focused team, even though our defense is right now the future. Passing game. Oh, we want Sam Howell to sling it. First rookie game. Let's go. All right, so we got to beat the Jags and throw for 350 yards and then focus on our offensive game plan. Easy enough. It's a beautiful day in Landover, Maryland, as the Jacksonville Jaguars come to visit our Washington Commanders. We got James Robinson, Trevor Lawrence, and our quarterback, our rookie, our guy, going up against the number one overall pick, Sam Howell, is going to be, you know, start his Hall of Fame career today. The start to his Hall of Fame career will have to wait as we kick off to start this season and this franchise. Nice tackle, Jalen Smith. They're down, this is a big play. We are gonna take away the running back and hopefully he doesn't go out on a route. Yep, we did, and he is going out on a route. Wide open. They did get the first thing. I just got toasted. Fumble, fumble, let's go. Come on, pick it up, pick it up, be someone. Let's go. Cameron Curl, Cameron Curl, MVP. Come on, all the way, all the way. Touchdown, let's go. First play, first touchdown of the season. Goes to Cameron Curl on a forced fumble. Let's go. We got burn on our user, but we make up for it. Woohoo. That's just good football fundamentals. First guy makes the tackle, makes the stop. Second guy comes in for the strip. We got it. The offensive line is rattled, so Chase Young should be screaming here. Scream at him. Come on. Oh, too slow. Nice tackle, though. I believe they have yet to run the ball. Legereus, fourth down. Antonio Gibson, <laughs> he is returning punts. That's at least realistic. And he did not get anywhere. All right, Sam Howell taking the field for the first time. You know, some, the school of thought is generally like your first play from scrimmage, whatever, is just run the ball, get some momentum. Not today. We are going to sling it all game long. And by sling it, I mean check down Antonio Gibson, who gets a gain of like six, well, seven. We'll take it. Gibson PPR owners are thrilled. We go for the screen here. I know I was hating on Gibson earlier for, you know, being the punt guy, but he's like super slippery and good at catching. We're going to use him for sure. All right, let's see if we can attack the seam here. If not, we might have Terry oh, roll out. Ooh. Oh, Sam Howell takes a sack. That's my fault, my fault. The first catch of Jahan Dodson's career is a third and 12 beauty of a conversion. Okay, Cam Sims, okay, Cam Sims. Okay, Cam Sims. All right. The end of the first quarter ends 7 0 with a defensive touchdown. We are on the move, though, so we're going to be, you know, hopefully in good shape. Want to see what Terry can do here? Nope, we got Ebron. Deep touchdown. Let's go. First touchdown is our free agent acquisition and our rookie starting quarterback. That means we're doing our job as a GM. Oh, there's some wind. 
Hopefully we make this. Wentz holding kicks. <laughs> oh, how the mighty have fallen. Yep, that makes sense. They ran the ball. Oh no, mm, my fault, my fault, that's my bad. I accidentally clicked on, that is not a good look. Trevor Lawrence gets a big catch to Zay Jones. I haven't seen a single Christian Kirk reception. I don't even see him on the field. The, like $80 million man sack Deron Payne off the edge. Let's go. Fumble. Oh my goodness. Another fumble. Legere sneaked on the pickup. Oh, he's number 16. Oh, that's that's yucky. I don't like that at all. But he's going to get two, two defensive touchdowns. Two? I mean, I'm not going to complain. Oh, 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 oh. Now this is on sim and it is all mad and difficulty, but we may need to adjust the sliders because this is getting a little ridiculous. Whoops. All right, we need to stop here. We cannot let them score before the half, especially after a turnover. Nice, Chase Young's first sack. We have like three sacks, four sacks now. Chase Young. That was disgusting. 2.2 seconds to the sack. That's like catching the ball. Like, let's time out 2.2 seconds. Ready? Like, one, two. And a guy ran 10 yards to tackle you. Like, that's disgusting. Okay, this is getting absurd. This is getting absurd. We just block a kick. Let's see if Terry can take the top off here. Zone coverage. Check down. Never mind. Gibson. Nice catch. Break the tackle. First down and out of bounds. Oh, no, he's on someone else. Oh, they're screaming. And we get sacked. We're going to take a timeout. We have three sacks. They have two. This is a cover two look. I think Dimey Brown should be able to get open here. He should. Wait for it. Wait for it. Throw it inside. Oh, that safety came in and played it. But we... We're going to go watch this replay. We, the only reason we made this throw is because Sam Howell's back. His play sense was like that this entire area was whatever, gray. And he threw it outside of it to where only Dimey Brown could catch it. That is amazing for Madden 23. There's no way that that happens in any other game. That was a sick throw. It's now 27 nothing. We're gonna get Brian Robinson some touches in the second half. That was disgusting by Montez Sweat. Tackle for a loss there. I think that's probably gonna take us to the end of the half. 27 to nothing. should have dots in there oh wait 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 run run sam howell rushing touchdown let's go that's huge for his stats but we do have an injury on our offensive line it's trey turner there's always something going wrong did we miss nope dislocated knee for trey turner oh my god that is horrible news. That's a couple week injury. We're going to have to replace him via trade or free agent or something. We can't be playing with a backup. I'm actually going to sim this possession for you. It punted. Jags are driving here. If Monte can make a play over the middle. Oh, it's not Monte, it's Cameron Curl with the pick. Oh my goodness, we're gonna get another defensive touchdown. Who played the Washington Commanders defense week one against the Jacksonville Jaguars? Three defensive touchdowns, three turnovers, at least three, if not four sacks, and zero points allowed. Oh my goodness. This game is getting out of control. We're just gonna sim, and actually Trevor Lawrence gets his first score once we come out of the game. 48 to 7 at this point, and that's going to be the final absolutely dominating performance for the Washington Commanders. A couple injuries we got to worry about, but otherwise a really, really, really strong start for our team as Sam Howell posts a 113.7 QBR, 222 yards, three touchdowns, 
two picks, which we definitely need to work on improving. Brian Robinson, nine carries for 53. Sam Howell, two for 17. Gibson did have five catches for 42. Dotson, three for 64. Ebron had two for 48 and two. Great free agent acquisition there. On the defensive side, we went off two picks for Cameron Curl, three sacks for Chase Young, one for Duran Payne, and then they split a couple. We'll check on injuries next week. This was an amazing start to the Commanders franchise. Make sure you subscribe and comment. Let me know what you're liking about this franchise, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Let's go.